All right, let's do a little orientation here to the Rancho Potrero open space. As it has some coyotes banging off to my side here. So this is, uh, so here we are. So this is the main entrance down here. And uh, we're looking at the, the large core of this property. This was originally part of the Broom family ranch. Um, it was acquired by the city of Thousand Oaks uh, in, the, uh, in, in the early 2000s. Um, and basically, um, this was an old uh, property. As we can see here, there are some abandoned home, um, home pads, uh, building uh, pads. Um, as far as context, Long Grade Creek, or excuse me, Long Grade Canyon right there, down to campus, CSUCI and the Oxnard Plain. Point Magoo is right over there. So behind us is Point Magoo State Park. This property does not touch Point Magoo State Park, but it's within about a half mile of the start of that property. Off to the side over here, um, as we look into the sun and Boney Mountain right there, uh, this is, uh, uh, the next parcel over is um, Santa Monica uh, Mountains um, National Recreation Area Unit uh, Rancho Sierra Vista slash Satwiwa. So that, that, that is contiguous with this property. Also just a little bit of a, of a cutout right there along the road is the Rancho Potrero Equestrian Center, which is also managed by Conejo Open Space Authority <clears throat> and, uh, and Conejo Parks and Recs. Uh, and that uh, area uh, is, is a little cut out where people have uh, horses, maintain horses. So you'll see possibly a lot of horses on the trails here and around. And then, um, and then we have uh, Potrero Road right here. It's Lynn Road over there and Potrero Road right here. Um, but uh, as we look uh, basically northward here, we look into the development, relatively new development of Dosientos. That also is relatively new um, disturbance, new fragmentation. Um, that uh, uh, large development started in 1997 with most of the houses being built around uh, 2000 to 2002 or so, in 2003, that, that that area. There still are a few undeveloped sort of McMansion parcels, but most of that development is single family homes. Uh, interspersed throughout that is a network of uh, dedicated open space, um, mostly on the, around the ridge lines. Um, for publicly accessible trails, etc. So that's the orientation to Rancho Potrero open space. Much of the area obviously is this big, um, uh, nice flat plain grassland, but it does include some of these uh, summits and, and uh, hillocks and uh, crests here, uh, just on the edge of the city of Thousand Oaks.